paper comes to the parliament, I need your help. Yes. Because if I vote for it, you don't want it. And if I don't vote for it, Jack wants it. But I'll tell you one thing. I represent the People's National Movement in the Parliament. And we don't take our position based on threats or personal agendas. In this particular case, as soon as and as long as something comes to the Parliament which represents the best for Tobago, the PLM support is available. If on the other hand, what comes to the parliament is not in the best interest of Tobago, well, no threat will change the PLM's position. So let's get that clear. But I want to talk to you this evening as Tobagonians, and I want to thank you very much for welcoming me as a Tobagonian. Because apparently, there's a move afoot to remove my Tobago heritage I've been hearing one or two Tobagonians with political difficulties questioning my tobago I want to tell them two things. One, I've been paying land tax on my grandfather's land in this world since I was 17 years old. That's the first thing. And secondly, I have 10 goats in this world in Tobago. I don't want to get around me. So once that is okay, it's okay with me. Because I know you can't choose your family, you could choose your friends. Yeah. And from the day I was born and my little string was buried in this wall, nobody could take away from me my Tobago heritage. Yeah. So let's put that aside. But what is it about Tobago that is important at this time in the country's history? What is important? for us and about us at this particular time. As we talk about this Tobago heritage, is our value system. When you are called a Tobagonian in Tobago or in Trinidad or anywhere in the world, it means something. It means that people from the small island where the value system is based on fairness, truth, integrity, and ambition. That's what it means. And if you fall short on any of those things, then you begin to let down Tobagonian. And all those who want to question my tobago I want them to look at their own record and see if they pass the test on those four counts. And until they can answer yes to everyone, just get out of the way and let the PM proceed to represent the PM. 